Paul is always saying that I should be trying to be more healthy. So today he has got me a bottle of Beetlejuice. Let's start the show. Beetroot. All right. <laughs> I'm not eating beetles, dear. No. So it's only fitting that we are wearing shirts and jumpers the same colour as the beetroot juice, right? So it's called Beat It. Wow. <laughs> yes. Anyway, it says this is an organic beetroot juice. Organic farming uses traditional methods like crop rotation and natural pest control rather than chemical fertilizers and pesticides which can end up in the final product. Artificial preservatives and additives are also a no-no and we get simply the best tasting juice on the market. I have never had beetroot juice before but I do like beetroot. So I don't know this might be okay but the thought of it sounds absolutely disgusting. So Beet juice contains antioxidants, electrolytes, and other compounds that may help support heart and brain health, among other benefits. Now, you first heard about this on Michael Mosley's TV show, isn't that right? I think either it was the TV show or the book that I'm reading called Asleep Something. Sorry, um. I will. I will put the oh, wait. name. Of Maybe you should get it. Where is it? On. Where is it? We need to see this book. Hell I was a little bit sort of reticent about watching Michael Mosley's show, where he goes through people's shopping baskets and looks at what they're eating and how healthy it is. But I actually got quite into it. Fast, fast asleep. asleep. Well, you were fast asleep when you were trying to remember the name of that book. I weren't you, Paul? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, well, this has been chilling. You see, oh, just it's just been chilling <laughs> in the fridge. So I think that we should open it up and... Why do I feel like it's going to be concentrate? Oh, no, no, I don't think it's concentrate. I think it's going to be strong. Yeah, maybe not fill the glasses the no. whole way, just in case. Now, before we pour it, I, oh, I want to smell it. Oh, gosh. Oh, it smells just like beetroot. No, <laughs> why should I be so surprised? Uh, before you, before you pour, before you pour, I've got a little story. So, there were always two types of beetroot when I was growing up, and I had both of them at my aunt and uncle's house in Carry Duff, just outside Belfast. They grew beetroot. Now the thing was, when they served it up fresh. For some reason, I didn't like it, but they also preserved some of it in pickle, I guess. And I that's... don't like pickles either. No, no, <laughs> I like that. And that's why today I like the preserved beetroot. I don't like it fresh. I don't... I... The only thing I remember about beetroot is that they served it at school in the school cafeteria. and. It was just red and I think it was either not fresh or I think it was like an ambient type one where it wasn't mm -hmm. fresh but then they got it from the can or something but then oh. whenever I had it then I thought this tastes off I didn't know what it was like that's kind of why I never actually liked it because it seemed strange Does that make sense? Oh! Well, I think we ought to start pouring, don't you, Paul? Yes, I have to. And at least if you spill it, it's not going to stain our clothes. No. Do you know what? I actually toyed with the idea of putting this into a wine glass. Because I thought oh. it does look like wine. Maybe, okay. maybe I would drink more as a result. <laughs> I don't really. Well, the thing I was gonna say, I, I was gonna say that I don't like the smell of it. But can it, I dilute this? No, it's, I think you're supposed to. It doesn't say to dilute it, does it? But can I? It says organic beetroot juice. Oh, with apple juice as well. Oh. Is that to sort of like tone down? 
It says the juice is unfiltered after pressing and some sediment may settle at the bottom of the bottle. One serving, which is 150 ml, <laughs> no. uh, from this bottle will provide you with one of your five a day portions of fruit and vegetables. Right, and it also says that once opened, keep refrigerated and drink within five days. Well, mm. cheers, my dear. Mm. It's all right, actually. Mm. Not too bad. Okay, this sort of tastes like tomato juice for some reason. Yeah, it's, it's a cross between yeah. tomato juice and red wine. No. I don't so like either of those, but the cross between them actually is just about palatable. No, I, and I also taste some celery in this for some reason. Celery? I don't think it said celery, did it? No, like, like, okay. I don't know, I'm, like, I'm getting a small hint of mm. Do you know, I'm actually sort of quite impressed with this. Um, I don't think I could drink a full glass of it. I think maybe like filled up to here or maybe a shot glass. What do you think? But well, I don't think drink more of this. I think yeah, you need to drink more, but I don't think I could sit down and like drink like a whole glass, a full glass of it in one go. Why don't we drink some more now while we analyze mm -hmm. what we think of this? Just a bit more. Well, what I want to know is, is why is it so good for you? You've done the research, Paul. It also helps lower cholesterol, I believe. Mm -hmm. That means... And does it fill you up? Does it, if you were hungry, would it make you sort of full? Uh, so, a drinking beet juice may increase plasma nitrate levels and boost physical performance so i think it's kind of like a natural um boost mm. uh, does it say that you should always wear a maroon sort of color when well, you're because drinking? you might like stand on something <laughs> straight I would. the straight beet juice is low in calories and has virtually no fat it's a great option for morning smoothies as you start your day oh Give you a nutrient and and, and energy boost. Okay, fine. We're not doing that. Um, they make you burp as well. May help reduce your risk of cancer. This might be something interesting for us. Mm. Why do you think I'm going to get it? Well, we're all at, at risk, aren't mm. we? I suppose. Especially with my stomach. Beets get their rich color from betalins, which are water soluble antioxidants. It also contains other flavonoids and polyphenolic compounds which may have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. Well, you know what they say, that, um, well, you've got to have uh, your five a day and why not make beating it one of your five a day, right? Hmm. Well, well, that's what it's called, beat it. I think it's always good to try out something new and especially if they have those claims about the cholesterol. Like I think for me, mine is particularly high. No, and then they also said something about high blood pressure. Ah, yes. Helping that, which yes. is something you suffer from. Right well, I, I do take uh, high blood pressure tablets. I take beta blockers and have done for a long, long time. But my blood pressure is usually relatively okay and it's either maybe as a, as a result of taking the medication or maybe it's just normal. But yes, so I would say this is actually quite quite good. I am impressed with it. I would drink a little bit of it every day but not a full glass. And I think I will try to have... Up to there. <laughs> so that, our half pint so, of beer glass. So that's like what? Like about. So I would have had the equivalent of a half pint. And you know what you could also do? You could actually trick people when they come round. What you could do is wine. Yeah, you could pour this into a wine bottle. And Why then, don't we do that? We'll trick someone. <laughs> no, we're not tricking you. We really would like you to subscribe to our channel, isn't that right, Paul? 
For those of you that haven't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button. It won't cost you a thing and it will really, really, really help us. And we are appreciative for all of you that will subscribe. Indeed. It won't cost you a thing, but it might ding. And for those of you that have liked anything you've seen, hit the like button and then it'll be like a thumbs up. Thanks for that. And also, please leave any comments you think will help our channel. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time. Cheers! Yours is empty. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want more? I've had my one a day now.